hey y'all what's up welcome back to my channel so today we have a really cute and hopefully quick try on haul from Shein, and today it's all about the tops graphic tees good to go dress it up dress it down style it street style it casual style it style it however you want so i got a couple tops i have one like little two-piece set but that ain't the main event so let's get into these tops for summer that you can style which and every way you want to. So if you would like to see what all I got, just keep on watching. We have, of course, usually she usually starts the video with what she actually has on. So the first two we have is this 90s baby. And if you didn't know, She's a 90s girl, 91, what's up? You don't know nothing about it. For all you Gen Zers out there that was born in like 99, 2000s and whatnot. Like, I mean, the 99s, I guess you're a 90s baby, but are you really a 90s baby? All shade, all shade. But anyway, so we have this simple black tee with the old English font. 90s baby, like I said, you can really do a lot of styling um, with these simple graphic tees. Um, I think I want to put together like a styling video of how different ways that you can style these shirts. But today I just want to show you what I got. So this is the first one. This is in a size, I think, 1X. Um, and like they really just fit like normal t-shirts. Um, you don't have to worry about the size. They have like, they're really, they feel good. Um, I think they're 100% cotton. They have good stretch. Um, the, the design is on there. Like it looks pretty secure. So we haven't washed this one yet. So that can be like the takeaway for like graphic tees. Cause sometimes, um, depending on how it was like made screen print or like, um, what do you call it? Digital print. It really just depends on how the shirt was made of how it's going to hold up. So like with me with black stuff, I only wash my blacks with blacks and then I tend to hang them up to dry so they don't get faded or have fuzzies because when you put them in the lows with the colors, then they get all the fuzz from the colors and your shirts aren't black anymore. So simple black tee, we wash it with blacks, we hang to dry. So let's move on to the next one. All right, so the next shirt that we have is this one that says cruising. It's like an old school drive-in type of feel, giving me like grease vibes. Um, I like the shirt just because number one, I like this orange color and I like the contrasting colors that were um, on it as far as the design. Now what I won't do is I don't like, I just don't, I don't do. So I'm going to end up painting these. I'm not even gonna say, but I'm gonna end up painting these. They will be they will match me so um i love this shirt just because of the the design of it and like i said the contrasting colors it's giving me it can give me like fall vibes so i think this would be a really easy piece to transition into a fall style as well but since it is a t-shirt you can definitely wear it for summer rock it how you want put on your hoochie coochie shorts and some tennis shoes fanny pack look girl you good to go simple easy to the point i love the sleeve length because you know with short sleeves people really don't pay attention to it i do for whatever reason but the short the sleeve length on short sleeves i like how this one is coming down pretty much to the elbow we have some that are up here and then you have like the little almost tank top type of vibe but i like this it's really just giving me effortless style vibes you know so here for it we're gonna do a little diy to it to get it how we love it but i'm here for this shirt again style it how you want easy peasy lemon squeezy moving on all right so next we have this butterfly screen not screen print digital print um top again save sleeve length as the last shirt um but what i really gravitated me towards this this is a more like subtle trend that's been going on if you really pay attention to like fashion and beauty and whatnot butterflies are it right now and i don't think it's just because it's like a summer spring when you see butterflies, you do think summer, spring, but it's just really been a trend lately. I've been seeing a lot on nail art. Um, I've been seeing it a lot with like different makeup and hair art, especially like the eyes, the butterfly on the eyes, the butterflies in the hair, butterflies on the shoe. So now we have a butterfly on the shirt. So I really was just feeding into that trend because I do like butterflies. I think they're like a good luck. Good luck. Um, are butterflies insects? There's like insect and bug. I don't know. There's something different, but it's a... Um, 
a beautiful insect to me. It's a good luck insect to me. Um, I'm saying insect like that's just right. But anyway, creature. Let me just go with that. Um, and I like the different colors that we have going on. I really actually probably could have done without the pink one. But I'm definitely loving the blue and orange. Those are compliments on the color wheel. Or is it blue and yellow? Anyway, they're compliments. So I honestly could have done without the pink. But I'm loving the like monarch butterfly and then this blue joint i don't know its name but we know we learned about monarchs if, if we didn't learn nothing else in science we learned about the monarch butterfly um so love it i think it's so cute and a lot of bigger girls were afraid to wear white and i think this is a way for you to if you know trying to ease into that type of color wearing white but you still have other colors to like kind of distract or camouflage or whatever your hesitation with the color is so here for it simple cute dress it up dress it down jeans sandals lace up do what's the never not it you know so i have one more shirt that really should have been a two-piece and then i have a two-piece set to show you so let's keep it going keep it going keep it going <sighs> all right so we already know tie-dye is on trend tie-dye is is it right now okay tie-dye everything tie-dye two-piece sets tie-dye shirts tie-dye scrunchies tie-dye socks tie-dye shoes, tie-dye, 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 tie-dye. Don't even sound like two words anymore because that's how Andre is just tie-dye. Not tie-dye, tie-dye. So anyway, we have this tie-dye print. Um, it was supposed to be a two, well, I thought it was a two-piece set. I could be tripping, I'm gonna put it on the screen so y'all can see if I was tripping or not. But anyway, I thought it was a two-piece set. It's supposed to come with a skirt. Um, but regardless, I love the top. It's definitely something that I would wear. Um, black denim, light denim, dark denim, distressed denim um white denim do a lot of things with it as you can see it is a crop top and then here i am like before i was talking about the sleeve length this one is a little bit shorter and of course the top is fitted we got like a semi mock neck not as tight as some mock necks could be or as high up on the neck um, but i like it it's a relaxed fit it's coming down well i can pull it down low enough in the back to still wear like a regular bra even if my bra does peek out a little bit on the sides i would still wear a regular bra with it just to cover up my insecurity area which is like my black my back rolls so here for it love it if you if you have the titties to do the under boob stuff this would be the shirt for that my girls don't hold up like that okay they don't hold up like that but anyway so like if you wanted to put like a cute bra under it so you could do like the peekaboo action and you know styling styling is key styling is key styling is key so absolutely here for this and especially like looking on it looking at it on camera against like my skin color i'm really really vibing with it even more than i was when i just looked at it and picked it out i'm here for it i like it she feels cute and then maybe my nails are setting it off too green 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 all right so let's move on to the last piece of this haul which is a two-piece set not necessarily going with the theme of this haul as for as far as just tops but we love two-piece sets so let me show you that right quick right quick all right so let me show y'all this two-piece set over the upper. so this is pretty much how i would wear this is like a regular bra but what i would do is like have a band new top have it open giving you some boho hippie ish vibes okay so we have this like light it's all lightweight cardigan matching with the print on the pant and then also this part is the same on the bottom of the leg so i'm absolutely here for it i'm loving this orange color um, i'm loving how it's flowy lightweight so i can get away with a long sleeve um to just just give you a different a little bit of different vibe um, I don't really go for boho stuff, even though I absolutely love it. And then again, we love two-piece sets because we're getting at least four outfits in one. We got one, two, three, and well, well three outfits at least. She can't count. Um, so you get at least three outfits with two-piece sets. So I could wear this as a dress without the pants, belted, safety pin, hat, whatever you need to do. I could wear the pants without the cardigan piece. You know we just we just got we got styles we got we got fits over here but i'm loving the way this fits and it feels so good so comfy i just want to move around in it and even the pants like this is not a really stretchy material but i think i got this set in a 2x and it's definitely fitting me how i need it to fit to see on a booty um i would say it's probably a little it'll probably be more like a like a culotte 
on someone that's taller than me. I am five one two ish, um, so it's it's pretty much hitting perfectly for me to wear it with sandals. So if you're taller than me, just an FYI. But I absolutely love this. So that is all I have from Shein. But let me talk to y'all right quick. Save this for last, cause uh, I know, ooh, I know. This is a serious conversation. This is serious serious so i know the influencers that you're going to be watching now especially if you've been following anything that has been happening within our world we know we're we're in shambles so <sighs> we're in shambles it's it's a lot happening in america um it, it goes on all around the world i don't want to get too heavy into it but i know as a watcher of youtube and a follower of influencers and people that provide me with information on clothing and retailers and products and etc that you're going to be looking for who who fought the good fight who was actually paying attention to the companies that they work with and now she and they they said a little bit i wish they would have said more and maybe done more um but they did say something which is more than some companies not companies that i personally work with but that i've seen especially like high-end designer companies and i don't buy designer ever anything designer that i have was a gift and um I don't really promote that on my channel, on my Instagram, on any of my social medias. I don't really do the high-end designers. It's unnecessary. I damn near can make it myself. It's whatever. So those companies have really, really, really been doing the bare minimum with the exact same statements across all of them. Um, so I will give a little kudos to Shein for actually saying something, speaking up, and standing on the side of Black Lives Matter because Black Lives absolutely matter. All Black Lives Matter straight gay lgbtqia plus all all black lives matter all black lives matter so don't care how you feel about that all black lives matter if you're on this channel you should know all black lives matter so um yeah i just wanted to give like a kudos and i definitely have been paying attention to especially the brands that i personally work with what they have or have not been doing i've cut ties with some brands all of that so I just wanted to let you know that I am paying attention to it um, I hope you've been paying attention to it paying attention to it too um, and just be mindful of where you spend your money and I personally will not endorse or collaborate with or promote any brands that I do not feel support my community which is black people um, so just had to put that two cents on this video in case you didn't know or think I didn't care. Y'all thought I was just a superficial influencer. Now, she got a little depth or whatever. She clowns, but she got a little depth. She care about the issues. So, yeah, do your part. Uh, I'm going to put links in the bio of, of course, all these pieces and whatnot. But for petitions and things for you to sign, organizations for you to donate to, and all of that good stuff. So, um, as hard as it has been out there in the world... Stay happy, stay joyful, do things that make you happy, do mental checks with yourself. And um, yeah, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. If you have not already, please subscribe. I would definitely appreciate that. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and I will see y'all in my next one. Stay true. Ice cold in this beat. Ice cold in this beat.